How Zinc Displaces Copper from Copper Sulfate by kscience.com When zinc reacts with copper sulfate, they react to form copper and zinc sulfate. This is an example of a displacement reaction where zinc is more reactive than copper, so zinc displaces copper from its compound, forming zinc sulfate and copper. So in this chemical reaction, we have a test tube and we placed zinc inside of the test tube and I'm writing Zn because this represents the zinc metal. And then we pour the blue copper sulfate solution into the test tube. So what's being colored in blue represents the blue copper sulfate solution, which is CuSO4 Aq for aqueous. As the reaction progresses, the zinc and copper sulfate react. A copper coating begins to form on the surface of the zinc. This happens because the zinc takes the place of the copper, forming zinc sulfate. So the solution of copper sulfate becomes less blue as the colorless zinc sulfate begins to form. This diagram shows how the copper is forming on the surface of the zinc. This happens because the zinc displaces the copper from copper sulfate, causing the copper to then form on the surface of the zinc. We can see the solution is less blue, as there is less copper sulfate solution and more colorless zinc sulfate solution. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Once the reaction is complete, we're left with colourless zinc sulphate solution because the zinc has displaced all the copper, forming 100% zinc sulphate solution, which is colourless. There is no more blue copper sulphate solution. And the zinc is now coated with copper on its surface. There is now a copper coating on the surface of the zinc as the zinc has displaced the copper from the copper sulfate, causing the copper to now be a coating on the surface of the zinc. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Pause the video here to practice the keywords. The answers will follow. Press pause to answer the questions. The answers will follow. If stuck, just rewatch the video. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. And don't forget to visit kscience.com for more videos, worksheets, and quizzes at kscience.com. And don't forget to like and subscribe.